Tonight, where the school superintendent is addressing guns being brought to school, even a threat on social media. Melody Hackney says this is a pivotal point to find ways to help students make better choices. Our Desiree Montia is on your side at 6 with more. In a letter, Superintendent Melody Hackney says students are struggling as a result of the isolation and unique consequences brought on by the pandemic. A struggle she hopes to address as the school district faces incidents like students bringing guns to school. Uh, a little bit unnerving. Um, you know, obviously there's a sense of nervousness. Barry Clark describes the emotions his nephew is feeling after two Hopewell students were caught with guns in school. One incident happened at Carter G. Woodson Middle on October 21st. The gun was confiscated and the student faced disciplinary action. Just two weeks later, a similar situation happened at Hopewell High School. The kids want to feel like when they go to school that they're safe. In this letter, Superintendent Melody Hackney addresses the incidents, including a social media threat made to Carter G. Woodson Middle on Tuesday. That was reviewed, addressed, it was determined that they didn't have uh, the means to be able to uh, follow through with anything like that. In her letter, Hackney describes the challenges students are facing, adding, quote, we continue to see a higher level of intensity in much of the misconduct some of our students are exhibiting. Well, we're trying to make sure that everybody is safe and well informed. To make sure everyone stays in the loop, Hackney says families will be notified of all serious incidents on the same day it happens through school related messaging apps. She will also present a plan to the school board to better enhance security in their buildings and prevention efforts to help kids make better choices. There are pieces about looking at mental health and just making sure that um, we're reaching people on a relational level so that we can really be proactive rather than reactive. Superintendent Hackney will present this plan to the school board on Monday night. For now, on your side in Hopewell, Desiree Montilla, NBC 12 News. Alrighty, thank you, Desiree.